guys welcome back to a new vlog i'm all ready to go to the gym but first i need to eat a little pre-workout snack so that is what i'm about to do today's gonna be just a day in the life vlog so just kind of following me around my day whatever i do today but yeah let's eat a little snack before going to the gym i've been getting these little spinach and bell pepper egg bites from costco and honestly you guys they're so good in my opinion and they have 15 grams of protein and i believe they're only like around 200 calories calories so it's not bad and since it's something very light i feel like this is perfect as a pre-workout snack normally i'll either have like cereal oatmeal or something like this whenever i feel like eating something before the gym and you just pop them in the microwave for 60 seconds so they're literally super quick and easy to eat it's time to make my pre-workout now after making a mess i finally have my pre-workout i mentioned in the previous vlog the pre-workout that i'm currently taking it's this one from gorilla mind or gorilla mode um and honestly it's a really good pre-workout my boyfriend's the one that did his research on it and he ordered it for us and it's a pretty big tub like comparing it to other pre-workouts it's normally like half the size of this and this was i want to say like 50 60 dollars and the one that he was getting before that was i think was bucked up that one was like 50 60 dollars and was way smaller than this but i really like it because it doesn't give you the jitters you don't feel like this form of like extreme energy or just over energized or anything like that like it doesn't make me feel crazy <laughs> like some of them do it just honestly gives me a really good like mental focus and without even noticing i like am pushing through my workouts and the first time i took it i was like i don't feel jittery i don't feel like over energized i don't feel like shit because sometimes pre-workouts make me feel like shit so i've been really liking this they have a ton of different flavors we got the volcano burst flavor and it's pretty good the only thing that i will say that i dislike about it is the texture it definitely has like a chalky texture to it but it's something that i can definitely like let slide by i always like to try different things like in the dietary supplement market as in like proteins pre-workouts and stuff like that because you never know something better might be out there and currently this is that because i hate feeling tingly and jittery and stuff like that so i like this for that but before i head out i want to slash need to create my to-do list for the day you guys know i can't like go a day without creating a to-do list so i'm gonna do this really quick i'm gonna have like a semi busy day there's just like random things that i need to get done like one get my nails done i literally peeled off the gel last night but they're super grown out so that's number one on the list okay so on the to-do list i need to get my nails done i need to do an ultra run like today because i'm out of my face wash um i am possibly gonna go to tj maxx i'm on the hunt for oversized tees for the gym because i literally don't have any oversized tees the ones that i did get from walmart last time i don't like them they're not over size enough so i need some new ones i need to order something online i need to edit a vlog i need to edit a tiktok i need to work on something else and yeah so it's gonna be a lot of computer work but also like a lot of running little random errands i'm gonna finish my pre-workout and head out to the gym it is a while later now you guys actually like a few hours later i got back from the gym ate breakfast showered and got myself ready I'm running a little bit late well, not really but i just need to apply some lipstick which is what i'm about to do i'm just gonna be using my charlotte tilbury pillow talk duo and i'm gonna go run my errands here is the comfy outfit of the day I'm just wearing these joggers from halara my new balance sneakers this crew neck sweatshirt from H&M, this bag from H&M, and I'm ready to head out. I am finally 
finally back from my outing and you guys i am starving so i'm about to make some lunch right now it's around 2 30 i'll give you guys a haul of whatever i bought at the stores but i'm so hungry i'm like getting in a hangry mood so i need to make food but here are the nails they came out super cute i wanted like an almond shape wine burgundy color so pretty happy with them <laughs> Let me give y'all a little haul of what I got. So literally when I was at TJ Maxx, um, I went like straight to the dog stuff because my dog obviously, and I found the cutest things. I got him two things. I'm just like, every time I go to the store, I always want to get him something. I'm like, is this what it's like to have kids? When you have kids of your own, I hear like people are like, oh, I always want to get them something. Hey, uh-uh, no. I always want to buy them something like buy them toys or clothes or whatever that's how i feel with my dog so no up up <laughs> okay anyways let me show you guys first what i got him so for thanksgiving we're gonna do like a pajama theme thanksgiving where, where we're just gonna be like comfy in pajama clothes and i found <laughs> these pajamas for him they're super cute. We're doing like neutral Thanksgiving colors. So I just felt like this would fit the vibe. Yes, that's for you, buddy. And then I got him this cute little knitted sweater, which I mean, come on, how adorable. We're growing his little clothing collection. Do you know this is for you? Do you want to put this on? You know it's yours, huh? And the main reason that I went to TJ Maxx was because I'm in search of pump covers like for when I go to the gym. I saw a fitness influencer, her name is Fit With Ilulia. Somebody asked her where she gets like her pump covers from and she was like men's section at TJ Maxx. So I was like, you know what? I'm gonna go do that. I just didn't try them on. So I'm gonna have to try them on, make sure they're oversized enough. If not, I'm just gonna go back and look for a bigger size. I got them in a size large. So here is this first one I got. It just says Corvette on it and it has like a cool design. It's pretty thin, but I don't mind that. I just literally want it to cover me up. The next one I got is this one that says Pink Floyd on it. Again, has like a cool graphic design. This next one is like a Beetlejuice one. I thought it was actually pretty cute. Looks like that. And all of these were $7.99, so not bad and this last one is goosebumps or it says goosebumps so i didn't really care too much for like what they said or looked like i just wanted them to be oversized and have some sort of graphic on them um so yeah those are the four shirts that i got and like i said i need to try them on and then the last thing i got i was literally just strolling around and <laughs> i got this a little garlic dicer i always complain about cutting garlic i freaking hate doing it i feel like it's one of those things that's just like annoying and kind of hard to do so hopefully this makes my life easier you literally just put the garlic in there and smash it down so pretty cool and then at ulta 
I was in, in and out pretty quickly from there. I just grabbed my go-to face wash and then I actually grabbed this new face wash that I've never tried before. It's new to me. It's from the same brand that I um, get my regular face wash from, but this one, so the one that I use all the time, it's a purifying foaming cleanser, which I love. It like cleanses my skin super good and it never makes me break out or anything like that. And then this one is a hydrating gentle cleanser and it's for normal to dry skin. And this one is for normal to oily skin, which this is my skin type. But the reason I got this one is because I wanted to use something different and more lightweight in the morning, something more moisturizing. Since I really like this brand, um, I looked to see what other cleansers they had and they had Oliver, hold on buddy, come here. You're lying to me. I literally forgot what I was saying. He made me forget what I was saying. But pretty much I wanted to get something for the morning that was more hydrating and moisturizing versus this one. It's more like clarifying and like really cleanses the skin, like removes dirt, oils and stuff like that. Um, so I'm gonna try this out. Hopefully I like it. It had pretty good reviews. And the last thing I got is this Bumble and Bumble post-workout dry shampoo mist um i don't know if you guys remember me talking about this in the vlog when i bought the bumble and bumble shampoo and conditioner well i finally got the little small size i didn't realize it was going to be this small but the small size is like 16 bucks and the bigger size is like 30 something dollars so i want to get the small one first to try it out before buying the big one but this is supposed to be like dry shampoo for sweaty post-workout hair and i always have like super sweaty hair after i work out like i should probably wash it but i don't want to wash my hair every time i work out so i always use dry shampoo but this is supposed to be for sweaty hair so hopefully this works out that's pretty much everything i grabbed from my little outing but now i really need to get to editing because i'm like behind on editing i've been slacking on it and i just need to get back on track so that's what I'm gonna do for like the next couple hours and also I want to catch up on the Kardashians because I also have been slacking on that I don't think I've, la I've watched like the last three episodes maybe that's what I'll do this evening as well I am finally done doing some editing I was very productive for like the last two hours I think I spent like two hours finalizing a vlog uploading it and then I just finished like editing another one I just need to like review it but i am done for the day doing that i'm just annoyed because for my some of my thumbnails i'll like film a clip of me like posing and then just screenshot it when it's more like sit down videos but i think i freaking not think i deleted the clip of the thumbnail video or me getting thumbnails of myself so now i don't have a thumbnail for my h&m video or my h&m haul which is annoying i know i can make it work a different way but still like now i have to think of something else it's currently six 49 so almost 7 p.m i think we're gonna shower my dog right now because he really needs a bath it's been a couple weeks since we have showered him and he's a little stinky so and after that i'll probably make dinner as well and kind of just have like a chill evening usually how the nights go but that's the current update for now hey. ollie do you like the showers oh my goodness